Hi, I'm Joanne Purton from Channel 7 Action News Anchor and Don't Waste Your Money reporter. I'm also an avid reader and a mom who knows the value of teaching your children to read and doing anything I can to just really help anyone in the community and encourage people in the community to read. And that's why I'm so excited to be here right now to talk about the first ever community read program. It's sponsored by the Neighborhood Library Association, the NLA if you will for short, and that consists of the Novi Northville uh, Lyon Township, Salem South Lyon, and Wixom Libraries, all those groups together. And it's got the mission really to bring people together from neighboring libraries to discuss and participate in programs selected to strengthen community ties and to promote literacy really among really a diverse group of people. So a community read, as I mentioned, is when these neighboring libraries get all these people together and encourage them to come together to read and discuss the same literary work and take part in events hosted by the different libraries taking part. So starting on August 16th, coming up here, you can join the Community Read by reserving a copy of this book. It's called Annie's Ghosts, A Journey into a Family Secret. It is by Steve Luxenberg. You can register for a variety of uh, related events that has to do with this work at the five neighboring libraries in the, in the association. To tell you a little bit about this book, again, it's called Annie's Ghosts, A Journey into a Family Secret. It is part really detective story, you could say, part social history, part memoir also, and it revolves around his aunt hidden away in the Eloise Institute in Metro Detroit. Now the search for answers for this gentleman in this book takes the story through Imperial Russia, Depression era Detroit, the Holocaust in the Ukraine, and the Philippine War Zone. One reviewer describes Annie's ghost as beautifully com complex, raw, and revealing. Annie's ghost also was honored as a Michigan notable book and one of the Washington Post's best books as well. So it's going to be an exciting read and we're really encouraging everybody to take part in this. There are book discussions groups on Annie's ghost scheduled at all of the NLA libraries as well as related events including, and this is exciting, so not just reading and talking about the book, but there's going to be a memoir writing workshop, there's going to be film screenings, and genealogy programs, which is really neat, starting in September and running through October. On October 21st, the NLA is excited to present a very special author event with the man who wrote the book, Steve Luxenberg, at the Novi Public Library. You can register at the Novi Public Library website at www.novilibrary.org. You can also call the library if that's easier for you by calling 248 Three four nine zero seven two zero. So please, we invite you all stop by the Novi Library, pick up a community read brochure. We've got these here at the library. You can also check out the Novi Library website to learn more about the community read book, about the events coming up, and the author as well. So everyone is welcome to attend the events and to check out copies of Annie's Ghost at any library. If you're watching from another area and you have a library closer, go ahead, one of those five libraries, you can pick up this book in all these cases in all of those places rather. So five communities unite for one book. What could be better than that? Another reason to love your public library.